If you would like to learn how to make something like this, love that pulls me closer with every heartbeat. I have wandered through kingdoms and crowned moments. Hey guys, welcome back to another Maggie Insights tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to create animated stories from scratch. We will be using design for our consistent characters in our animation, and we will also be using ChatGPT for our prompts in our script. Now, if you're looking into storytelling, this tutorial is going to be just for you. Now, grab your device and let's get right in. Okay, so first we're going to start off by using ChatGPT to provide us with some scene ideas. And also later on, I'm going to show you how you can use it to provide you for a script as well. First, I'm going to ask it to provide me a full scene for an African-American female and male. Both of them are kings and queens in a royal palace. And I'm also going to ask for it to describe the features, the outfits, as well as any other attributes as well. So this is the description that I have to start off with. And I'm just going to hit enter. As you can see, in just a few seconds, ChatGPT was able to provide me a full detail description for this scene that I'm trying to make an image of. Now I can go in here and edit some things such as the character features. As you can see, I tweaked up the prompt a bit. I edited some of the details and this is what I'm working with. Now the bold section is the one that I'll be copying and I'll be inserting for our first prompt in design where it discussed mainly the features. So I'm going to copy it. Now let's head over to design so I can insert that. So this is design and this is where we will be creating our characters, our consistent characters from scratch for this short story film. And these are the pricing plans for design. Now to do what I'm going to show you today, it is recommended that you get this plan and up. The beginner and the free plan, I don't think they offer consistent character options so you would need this one or this one in order to do what i'm going to show you today but i'll be working with this one over here so once you're logged into design you first want to click on new project and then we're going to click on 16 by 9 and click apply on the left tab over here you're going to click on character and at the very top you're going to click on build your character in my previous videos, I discussed both sections over here, but I'm going to go with quick mode and I'm also going to go with start with description. I'm going to name the character. I am working with two characters, but I'll just be putting one name for now because the name does not really matter for this portion. And this is where I'll be pasting what I copied. So this prompt mainly focus on the features for this male and female character that I'm going to generate. Now I'm going to click on view all styles. Out of these options, I'm going to scroll down and select tune face. Next, I'm going to click generate character. Okay, so these are the options that it generated. You can always click the magnifying glass to see it closely. I think I'm satisfied with these images. So I'm going to select this one over here to the right and click start building. Next, you're going to click use and consistent character. So these are the two results for this setting. So I'm going to delete this image over here. Out of the two, I think this one on the left looks a bit more modern to me, mainly because of the floors. I'm gonna click this icon here to place it on the canvas. Now I'm going to expand it and position it to fit the entire frame. Now for the fun part, we'll be adding lip sync to our characters. On the left tab over here, you're going to click on this lip sync icon. Next, you're going to click on pick a face image. And now you're going to click on the image that we would like to lip sync. Now you'll notice these blue select box on the character faces. You can select what character you want to speak first by clicking on that character. And I'm going to click on her. And then I'm going to click on him. And then I'm going to click next. In that order, character A, which is the female, will be speaking first, following character B, the male. Now, before I dive in to pick a voice and add in their dialogue, let's head on over to ChatGPT so we can come up with a script to insert here. All right, guys, 
So I went ahead and typed in a prompt for ChatGPT. I typed, give me a one minute script for a scene of a king and queen in love. And this is the script that it provided over here. After reading the script, I realized I wanted something a bit more poetic. So I changed the prompt to give me a one minute poetic script for a scene for a king and queen madly in love. And this is the result for a poetic prompt. As you can see, ChatGPT provided me with a full detailed poetic prompt script. Now, if you struggle with coming up with storytelling ideas as well as storytelling scenes, ChatGPT is the perfect place to help you out. Since I selected speaker A to speak first, I'm going to be copying her line and that's what I'm going to be inserting in design. So for speaker A, the female, I'll be clicking on pick a voice and she will be speaking first. Now you have text to speech over here and you have upload an audio. In my previous videos, I show you how to upload an audio, but today I will just be working with text to speech for this specific script. So I'm going to paste my script for the female character here. Now I'm going to go through these voice notes over here and select a voice that I would like for her. I think I'm going to go with Brittany over here and click generate audio. And I'm going to preview this voice closer with every heartbeat. Now this is a new feature in design where it allow you to play the audio with the script. And I think I like how it sounds. So I'm going to click apply for her. And I'm also going to want to do the same for speaker B. I'm going to copy his line. And for speaker B voice, the male, I'm going to click on pick a voice. Speaker B, I'm going to paste his script here. And I'm going to go with this James voice over here. And I'm going to click Generate Audio. I'm going to preview a snippet. Through kingdoms and crowned moments. I think that sounds great. So I'm going to click Apply. Now you'll notice the audio for the voices right underneath the timeline. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to drag the male voice, Speaker B, all the way to the right. I want to make it overlap just a bit so that when she's finished speaking, he starts his line. Now I'm just making sure that the images matches the audio. And I'm going to click play to preview. Be closer with every heartbeat. I have wandered through kingdoms. All right, so if you're satisfied with your audio for your clip, in this lip sync section over here, you're going to want to make sure that Pro is selected because you get the best and high quality. So I'm going to make sure that it's checked off. And now I'm going to click generate. And it'll be submitted and it should take about 20 to 30 minutes for this entire process to be completed. Now that the video is complete, you're going to click on download and it'll be saved to your downloads folder. One more thing, you'll notice that we only completed just one scene. Now, if you wanted to make this longer and complete more scenes, you would pretty much repeat this process and put the clips together and that's how you'll get a full script. And now let's view the final results. And yet, even this golden glow seems but a whisper compared to the fire I see reflected in your eyes, the fierce, unyielding tide of love that pulls me closer with every heartbeat. I have wandered through kingdoms and crowned moments, yet never have I known a love so vast, so enduring, that it could make eternity itself seem fleeting in comparison. And that's it. I just showed you how to create animated stories using design and chat GPT. If you follow these steps, you'll be making your own stories in no time. Now, if you found this tutorial helpful, please make sure you hit the like button, subscribe to this channel, and hit the bell icon for more tips and tricks Comment below on what kind of stories you plan on creating. I would love to see your ideas. And remember, happy creating.